I'm looking at the Stella X3 large diaphragm condenser microphone. Now I'm going to open it up. Have a look what we get in the box. It comes uh, plastic sealed. And then I shall set it all up and give it a try out. I believe this has got its own little carry case as well. Details there and instructions, and it's all contained within the case. So let's move the box out of the way. This little case. on the bottom to so stand up and that plastic on there so it'll lay flat a zip bag and got the shockwave stand let's just set that up on there You've got the microphone itself. And muffler. Goes on there. Anyway, I shall set it all up and then I shall start testing it out and come back with that. I've been using this now since it arrived and uh, yeah, I'm quite impressed with it. Sounds very nice, uh, very natural sound. Um, you've got the two buttons on the front, you've just got the high pass button which reduces um, proximity effect when speaking up close uh, to the microphone as well as background noise and you've got the uh, minus uh, 10 dB if you've got, uh, you know, if you're recording loud noises and that. Um, the specifications of it, um, it's got a frequency of 20 Hz to 20 kilohertz. The microphone has a cardioid polar pattern. A sensitivity of minus 33 dB. An impendence of 110 ohms. Uh, a max SPL sound pressure level of 135 dB. And equivalent self noise of 8 dB, which isn't bad. Anyway, uh, as I say, it's... Uh, Quite neat, I've got this on this little stand, I've got an arm but I thought it was better to show it on here. And you've got the logo on the front, as I say, all metal mesh grill. Um, what I'll do is I'll, I'll do some recordings, uh, testing mainly the um, high pass and uh, I'll put them on the end and then I shall give my full written review. This is an audio test with the high pass turned off. The quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. This is an audio test with the high pass turned on. The quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog.